What's up guys, welcome to Rotor Ride. I'm Let's Fly RC. And I'm Bubby FPV. And we are here in Staten Island, New York with Xavier, who's a cinema drone pilot, is that right? That's right, also known as Drone X Factor. I come from the background of cinema drones, one inch sensors, half inch sensors, cinematography, the Mavic Mini 2, the Mavic Air 2, the Mavic 2 Pro, the Autel Evo 2 Pro, oh, nice. 8K, 6K, you name it, Inspire 1, Inspire 2. Yeah. All over New York City. I started FPV when the DJI FPV was released. I promised the, everyone on my channel that the day DJI releases an FPV drone, I will get into FPV. And I didn't expect them to do it. <laughs> and when they did it, I was like, crap, I gotta learn this. <laughs> it looks really hard. Well, did you see any of our videos on Rotor Riot? Did that get you inspired yes, at all? Yes, I or? did. I That's saw great. some of the Rotor Riot videos and I was like, ah, I need to do this, I need to do this. I started with the simulator. Our second flight, I crashed the thing, the DJI FPV, and I was like, this is not gonna work. Did it break? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> All four arms. Oh my gosh, oh my that's God. crazy. So then I bumped into, I think it was Stacy online and then she referred me to Drew and was like, hey, they build nice. drones over there at Rotor Ride. I was like, give me something. So you've got a Skylander also? I have a Skylander. Oh, that's awesome. That's the, that's the frame that I fly and I fly it because of the same reason. You can't break the Skylander, it's awesome. So have you flown the Skylander yet? Or is this gonna be your first time here? It's gonna be my first time flying anywhere outside of Flushing Meadows Park. I've never flown anywhere else except oh there. Oh my gosh. FPV, well. I've flown the GPS stuff, but FPV. So this is like, uh, I'm a little nervous nice. over here. No, this will be great. It'll be a good, exciting but change for you. I have, I crashed 50 times. Oh my gosh. That's what kind of what you'll learn with like this FPV drones. We like send them really hard and we crash them hard. So these are going to yeah. be really durable. Okay, like, well I have a brand new GoPro, so hopefully I don't wreck it. Hopefully. It's a Hero 9. This is nine. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's where you printed. Okay. I, okay, I thought that was so real. This is something we hooked him up with. This is a, a GoPro Ballast. What's Because he, he was wanting to start practicing flying without risking an actual camera, mm. but he wanted it to feel the same. So he didn't want to have like, okay, so I'm going to practice flying, and then when I add the GoPro, it's going to be all this extra weight. Yeah. So we work with Noozle 3D to make a ballast that so it's the exact same oh exact same whoa so yep. is, there, is there like rocks in here or something or? there's pennies there's pennies, yeah. there's pennies. Know, I, I don't know if you're printing so he heavy. prints it halfway then stops it at a point where the their slots are deep enough puts the pennies in oh that's cool and then hits resume printing and then it keeps printing so the pennies are like built into there you know He's a lot better than I thought. He just went up and did a flip and just crazy stuff. Okay. I don't know how much I can teach him. He's doing really good. Oh. Wow. Like, not gonna lie, I went into this expecting you to like, be not know the controls in acro mode too much, but you seem very in control of everything you're doing. Have you ever done a power loop before? What is that? A power loop is like, so you know like a plane will do a loop? Yeah, like a roller coaster, how it does a loop, like you just keep going back. And up, you know that? Okay, I'll try it. Just keep powering and 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 flip. Like yeah, but power like, flip. Kind of, yeah. Like a back, like a back flip, but you're giving power to. Underneath, it, yeah, like that. Yep, like that. It's perfect. Yep, that's a power loop. And then you got to. Yep. Sweet. Oh, oh, shoot! That was yeah. close. <laughs> there you go. That was sick. So Almost. you see, you see those like big gaps in the pipes over there. Pipes. Yeah, right yeah. there, straight ahead. Try to power loop one of those. So you're gonna go under it, go you're back. Do a back flip. Go yep. Do a back flip. So with a power loop, you kind of have to give throttle when your quad is perpendicular to the ground so you can shoot yourself back. You lost me there. I come back and I'll show you. Come back? Yeah. There we go. Nice. That's so let's great. pretend his hand or arm is one of the pipes, the, <coughs> the top part of the pipe. For a power loop, you want to go under the pipe and then throttle up and go like this over the pipe. Okay. And then, and then come back through it? And then come back through it. So it's like, you remember how you're doing a backflip? Yeah. It's very similar to that, but instead of giving all of the mo the the all of the stick movement at once so it's fast, mm -hmm. it's basically like a slow backflip with a lot of power. Okay. Got that? Yeah, so, so what's gonna happen? So I guess like one big tip I would have for you is when trying to clear the gap is you're gonna have to like, when you're like this, give throttle so you go past it. So I guess I'll demonstrate it to you yeah. first. We're gonna try to go through this gap over here to do the power loop. See this one right here? So with this power loop, like I said, I want to go up and back over it, like that. And what my stick is, what my sticks are doing is, I'm using only the pitch axis. So that is the, the right side back and forth. Okay. And then when I am, when I'm pitching back, I'm giving throttle to shoot myself back over the gap. Okay. So you kind of see like how when I am at like 
the top or pitched like that. I have to give throttle to make sure I yeah. go back. Okay, now, yeah. question: You're going awfully high. Can you do it like smooth and low? Is that a thing? Or yeah, it's you can not do it possible? as tight as you want. Let like, me see how tight you can do it. See, like really tight. So it's all just a feel thing. Once you start doing more power loops and more tricks, you'll get a feel for like how far you're going and stuff like that. So you think you kind of got an idea? You need. I to got an idea now. Let's do this. So I guess just try to do that same gap that I did, or one of those big ones. We might go for this time. So you see how you didn't go over the gap? Uh, you gotta I didn't. Give more throttle to push yourself back over the gap. Yes. I don't think I hit the right gap, but it, you did a power loop. That's all that matters. was a power loop. That was a power loop. Yes, that was a okay. very clean power loop too. Wow. <laughs> so this time, try to go back to the same gap you went through, you know, when you started. Wow. Oh, 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 oh. So we'll go what get that. that. Here's the thing. The drone is probably perfectly fine besides maybe a prop. Briefly, when you we when I was flying, you touched on tight power loops, and that right. power loop you did was really tight. So you, I think you just hit the top. Click the top, okay. Yeah. So yeah, only damage looks like a prop. Based off the skill level that I'm seeing of him already, yeah, I think we can get him to Manny Flip. What? He just did the power loop like first try. That'd be... That'd be pretty legit. Be, he's gonna go from not, not even knowing what power loop means to do Manny Flips in one day. Yeah. That'd be insane. That would be insane. There's this other trick I kind of want you to do after seeing your experience and how skilled you're on the sticks. It's called the Manny Flip. And it's essentially the reverse power loop. What you're doing is you're pitching forward and going through the gap backwards. Whoa, that sounds wild. So remember with the power loop, you were going like this, right? Back through. With a Matty flip, you're starting on top of the gap, like this, and you're going like that. Whoa. It's a really difficult trick, and it takes wow. like, I, I did my first one after a year of flying FPV. After a year? But here's the thing, it also took me like six months to do a power loop as clean as you did. So I think you have the skills. It's like an extremely advanced but, trick. Oh, dude, like he, he's doing in between power loop and Matty flip, there's like so many things that you could do. Rubis cube, split ass, barrel rolls. But screw it, just go straight yeah, for the Matty flip. Let's do it. Let's yeah. do it. Because you know what? This is a good Matty flip obstacle. You're going to fall into it. So the more vertical space you have to play with, the more you can fall and pull back out of it. So you've got good height with this, which is nice. Like when you get good, like you could Matty flip something small, like one of those railings. If you get really good at what? timing it. What railings? Like, like those rails? Like you could, someone could. What a, with that size thing? Yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I, I could I, do I, it with thing. enough. I, I might flip myself. Tries. I wouldn't need Well, with a micro drill, with a micro. <laughs> So I'm gonna go ahead and find the biggest gap I can, or like the one with the most clearance. So let's just say this one right here. Second. Okay, in the middle. Yeah, this one right here. So with the Matty flip, we're gonna start on the top of the gap, and we're gonna push ourselves forward and back through it. I'm not gonna talk while I do it because, yeah. Oh shoot. Yeah. So you kind of get the idea. Oh shoot. Kind of get the idea. Like you want to see. Okay, but that was tight. So with this trick, you have to do it pretty tight or else you hit the ground. Okay. I'll show you again. That wow. wasn't even, I guess I'm not doing them very good, but I'm, I'm doing them sufficiently. Like there, that was a good one because I can see the object the whole time. So a really difficult part about this trick is if you're lined up awkwardly like that or whatever, you won't see the object and you won't know if you actually went back through it. So oh, it's, yeah. ki it's kind of blind. It's a blind, you got to yes. average. So like. Oh, that was nice. Yeah. Yeah, but wh I'm asking why you, when you come out of it, why are you turning around? Why aren't you like flying backwards because or something? Because if I keep going backwards, next thing you know, I'm gonna hit something. You hit back something. There. Okay. Yeah. So, so why aren't you going forward? What's that? Why are you like spinning around? Because you're not sure where you are? Is that yeah, what I'm it is? just turning around to get oh, okay. out of them. Yeah. To get out of them. Okay, so, so I should turn to get out of it too? Yes. Yeah, so the, oh, the only part of the Manny, the Manny flip itself is the over and going back through the gap. That's that's the mighty flip, it's done. Okay. Now this is just me getting away to, okay. re to reset. So do the, the mighty flip again, I wanna see. Okay. It's just that momentary thrust yep. when you think that you're at that point to kick out. Yep. Okay. Wow, that was nice. And what I'm also what I'm doing is so you'll kind of notice how the pipes are not in the middle of my screen visual the whole time. So I'm almost looking to the side a little bit so I can see where the pipes are. So like, 
You'll see how like in the middle of the screen, the pipes are not visible. But if you look like, in the top left, you can uh -huh. see the pipes. Okay. Let's do it again. Just as a just as a visual. Ah, uh, got right. it. Just as a visual. Wow. That's yeah. That's tight. That's some tight flying right there. Got it. Cool. You ready to try it? No promises, right? But I'm gonna give it a shot. There's a point when you're about to try something and you got this voice at the back of your head that just says, it's a really stupid idea. Yeah, <laughs> yeah this is one of those moments. You ready? I would try to manipulate the same one, same one that I was doing because it's the easiest. Which one are you doing? The middle? Uh, yeah, right there. Straight ahead. That one. So. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. oh. What was that? Uh, so what happened was you didn't throttle back. You throttled forward. So I didn't get the flip. Yeah. So it's, I, you, did a more, you did a more of a fast flip. So I would do more So wait a minute. I was supposed to throttle backwards. Yeah, yeah, when you're backwards. Throttle backwards. That's there's no throttle backwards. There's well, what I, what I what I mean by throttle backwards is the orientation of the quad. The quad is going backwards when you give it throttle. Oh, okay. And so, oh, oh, oh. That's not good. That's not good. So, yeah, it's probably fine. So what happened was you were trying to do the power, the Maddie flip way out here. And instead, you want to kind of have it tighter to the pipe. Right, so I'm having a hard time with finding out with how am I oriented. I feel like when I went over here and I lost the pipe, which mm -hmm. is not good, I didn't know where I was. I kind of just guessed to push some more and then kind of hoped that I was there and powering up. In a case like that, if you don't see the pipe, bail. Just don't, you don't need to try it every time. You can always bail out. So like, if you don't see the pipe and you're like, oh crap, where am I? Just bail. Just bail. Okay. And then, but so I guess something that can help you with that hopefully is, so let's say the gap, this is the pole. I think you're starting off like way up here. Go closer. Try to do it closer. So you so it's more of a tighter thing. And like okay. you know how you lost visual of it? Yeah. It's because your drone was not pitched forward enough. You were like this when at this point you should be like, like this. That. So Got it. so basically just the goal use more pitch into it. The goal with this Matty flip to make it easier is you want to have the pole, the pipe or pole, whatever you're Matty flipping in sight the whole time. So you're seeing the pole all, all the time you go around. Got it. Got it? Got it. So remember, you can always bail if you need to. Okay. okay. You don't have to try it every time if you don't think you're lined up properly. I almost did it, I almost. You were close, I you were close. I was so close, I you felt it. That time, you did the pitch perfectly, right? but you dropped too far. Okay. Like, you're doing the pitch, you're perfect. But then you just didn't give throttle like to when catch yourself. To catch myself. Got it. Because I gotta go. Oh. This is gonna be my last. It's now or never. So unfortunately, he has to go like after this pack. So it's like do or die right now. Let's do this. I'm gonna try something. Gonna tr what are you gonna try? Oh yeah, let's go try it. That's the kick out. No, and, but, oh, that's so not the you, kick so, out. I'm going forward. Yeah. So you want to. You want to have your flip level out so you're level and you're not facing forward. So. Okay. I just have a hard time visualizing it. Like, okay, tell me when to power up. Let's just say I'm going through the flip. Now, now. that's when you would. Maddie flip. Take one. And remember, you want it to be kind of tighter. Cause yeah. Now. Oh. Whoa. Oh man. We're out of time. But. We're out of time. Well. So, do you think you'll, like, with this experience of learning the money flip, do you think you'll go, go and try it again and maybe, yeah? I think the next time you see me, I'll make it a point yeah? to show you that I won't let you down. <laughs> you sent it for us. You did amazing. I appreciate it, nothing guys. to be. I had fun, but I've got to take it to the next level. <laughs>
So yeah, he told me he'd been going out for for a while, and he's he's been out a couple tries. That's awesome. Hasn't had luck, but he seems confident today. Yeah. All right, guys. <laughs> that nervousness <laughs> you can see. <laughs> yeah. I remember like I felt the same way the first time I was like when I was learning Maddie flips. I felt the same way. Yeah. It's like oh boy, here we go. And right into the crash. <laughs> he's so ferocious with that takeoff. So, yeah. Oh, dude, he's getting so dude, that close. Was, that was really good. Look at this. Oh my. Oh, dude. this third person shot is awesome. Yeah. They like built a gate. Xavier, I'm so impressed with the effort he's putting into this. Dude, he had like a, that curve looked really good on the drone. He's got the fundamental down yeah. for sure. Let's give it another go. Oh, that's, see, that's a nice bailout. What he did right there, that's the way you bail out of it, right? So if you're flipping forward and you lose sight, you can just continue the front flip and fly away from it. I appreciate that thus far he's really been going full commit yeah. and saying, well, I'm either gonna smash the ground or I'm gonna make it, <laughs> yeah. but, but it's good to see that, okay, he's learning that you can bail out of it. Yeah. And even that, so even there he oh, is. Oh, 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 dude. I mean, he touched, he touched, he touched. The ground. I feel like I almost had it. Dude, this, you did have this it. This battle basically. is so relatable. Yeah. This oh. battle, it's, it's such a... Yeah. Oh, he's trying, you see that? Yeah. Oh, oh, yes. oh, oh man. Nice. That was sick. Here we go. Does he do it again? Again! Oh my god. Oh my god. Dance. Dude, I totally relate Slow to that. Dance. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I'm so happy he did it. Oh man, yes! let's go. I'm stoked. I did it. You know, you gotta build a little rhythm and then a little whoop. Hey, whatever it takes, right? Big shout out to the guys at Rotorite. I feel like I still got a long way to go, but this is definitely a good start. That was so cool to see his progression. Yeah. I mean, we, started, we just totally built on all the progression he was making that day with you. And he was, I think, really lucky to, to get to have you right in his ear coaching him because he got really close that day, put the commitment in, built an obstacle to yeah, make it happen. I, and he did it. He did it. I'm really proud of you, Xavier. Big shout out to Xavier. Thank you so much, dude, for uh, putting in the work, making this happen, and sharing this journey with us. I really think it's gonna be inspirational to a lot of people. If you guys wanna keep up with his story, make sure to go check him out on YouTube, Drone X Factor. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you wanna continue to follow along with all our content, of course, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Smash the bell while you're there so we can notify you every time we post something. Guys, I'm LaDrib. I'm Bubby FPV. And we will see you next time on Rotor Riot.